Hello, my Gypsy family. I am here at Fireman's Park in Sturdivant, Wisconsin. We have so many beautiful parks here. I'm actually here watching my niece play baseball. So I will show you a little bit of that today. And let's go see what else we can get ourselves into today. Here we are at Charcoal Grill for my dad's birthday. I am so excited. Look at that burger. It's got onion strings and barbecue sauce on a pretzel bun. It's amazing. I am so full. Now there's my niece Leela playing out there on the baseball field. Go Leela. I remember Scott used to do that all oh the God. time. Scott used to pick daisies and... <laughs> Travis? Travis? Joey left me for a baseball game, so I am getting some coffee and make some cinnamon rolls. Shots espresso. Be still, my heart. Making some vegan cinnamon rolls. Look at that. That looks delicious. I love this brand. Whoop, I got some cinnamon on there. Ah, oh, lots of cinnamon, lots of cinnamon. Maybe I should put some cherries or strawberries in it too, but it's gonna be so good. I'm gonna roll this up tight. And then we're going to cut it up and let it rise and put it in the oven. Ooh, it's all set. We're going to cut this up and let it rise. Ooh, that looks so good. So we're going to put them all in the pan and let them rise up. And they'll be all ready to pop in the oven as soon as supper comes out of the oven. And they will be ready for nice, good dessert. And then tomorrow morning, ooh, this will be so good with some coffee. I love my coffee. Coffee and sweet rolls. I always like to put the butts, that's a butt, on the bottom so you don't see it. Ooh, eat it. Eat it. Mm. Can't go far without my coffee, but there we go. I'm going to cover it, let it rise. For later on with some coffee and then oh tomorrow morning with coffee oh eat it eat it okay so i covered them and i'm just gonna set them in my little oven here and let them rise for at least an hour so they get puffy and nice bye little babies let's check them out Oh, look at that. They're so big and fluffy. So I'm going to preheat this oven so that they are ready to go in. Oh, I love baking at home. Let me keep this covered. Well, I preheat this oven, bake, and we'll go start and we'll let it preheat. A little more time for oh these are already fluffy enough oh look at those oh I can't wait to put them in the oven they're gonna smell so good they smell great already and they're pretty simple to make pop them in the fridge and let them rise overnight instead of let them rise in the oven or somewhere warm <laughs> and then take them out and bake them for breakfast or snack mm. gotta have some coffee though Okay, so they're ready for the oven, and the oven is preheated. I like to put some more, some goodness on here, and it's hard to do with one hand. <laughs> so I'm gonna wipe a little bit on top, just to have them brown. And um, don't ever push. Oh no, no, no! You never want to push on the babies because they will flatten out, and they won't be nice and fluffy. But yeah, just use what you have. A little bit of butter, egg wash, all buttered up. We like this brand. The last one we used had a... I believe it was olive oil. A more olive oil base, but this is really good. I love this. And this, uh, 
Joey's mob right up from Mexico. Look at that. It's so sad. It's like crack. <laughs> we use this in our baking. Let me tell you, it is good vanilla. Never use imitation. And if you use the clear, it's good for your buttercream. Good. Thank you, Sue. Woo, it went into good use. Yeah, now we're ready for our dessert to go into the oven. Our coffee's hot. And we're about to eat some good stuff. Wow, my house smells amazing. I don't know if your oven, I'm sure it does, have these little vents at home. I love cooking at home whenever I can. Look at that. Let the heat come out. Let me check them. I like to check them like three-fourths of the way through because I don't like anything overbaked. Because once they're out of the oven, they'll still continue to cook. So never overbake. Just slightly under. Okay, probably another five, ten minutes. Oh, so good. I hope so. Oh, they look great. Oh, I wish you could smell this. This is amazing. This is the best little dessert for your coffee. Have this, watch a movie, let it cool down a bit. Okay, televisions. When are you coming out with smell-o-vision? Because this is amazing. Okay, they're all ready. I like to eat them somewhat hot, though. Let's see how these turned out. Mm. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That is so perfect. That looks amazing. Then also, ooh, that looks so amazing. Oh, so good. I like to um, add my little bit of glaze or a little bit of glaze or whatever I'm doing when I'm ready to eat because then I can have a lot if I want or I can have a little bit. Plus, when you put glaze on a lot of things, it seeps right into the beautiful roll there. And then you don't taste it, so I like everything fresh. Well, hello, my little friend. You look so delicious and you smell so sweet. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell. You smell so delicious. You're going to go well with my coffee. Bon appetit. Have a great night. Or have a good morning. Depends on what time you see the video. But, oh, dessert.